question for my fellow like creators um so this is what happened i already had like a chit chat get ready with me done um and it wasn't my favorite thing but i was happy with my editing and i finished and when i hit like upload like my card on the camera it's like a usb card no it's just like a card like a memory card right and then i insert that into my computer and then i just use imovie very simple but i didn't notice that like even though i was like editing like the clips it didn't like download into iMovie like I don't know how the fuck that happened but it did so come to find out that I had to like download the clips again and then well yeah like that didn't do anything because I still had to edit the whole clips again and I was like hell no to me I was like it's a sign just don't go through with it but attempt this for the third freaking time and I was a little bit more inspired today because I got some Glossier products so yay that's what this video is going to be about if you want a chit chat get ready with me then make sure you keep on watching uh i'm gonna be doing like a mint makeup not gonna be anything crazy so i'm gonna be using this new palette well new came back came out like in january i think it's mint to be from ColourPop, and i'm gonna be using zeltster which is this really pretty i'm not gonna do like a crazy makeup look today it's just gonna be like mint and I'm not gonna wear falsies because since I'm not somebody that wears um, falsies that often or even mascara like I don't wear mascara every day so when I do like my eyes are freaking sensitive like honestly I can't wear mascara or or false lashes for more than like five hours because my eyes start getting super freaking irritated why so yeah, just let me know how you're doing. Um, if you are privileged enough to stay at home and work from home, or if you have to be an essential worker like me. Um, I work retail at um, a very large company. Right there, should let you know where I work. Uh, so yeah, that's why I honestly haven't really been like uploading because like that's been like kind of like stressful for me. You know, just making sure you are, like, like being aware, constantly aware of what you're touching and make sure you are cleaning everything and, you know what I mean? Like, just, like, being very careful and just watching other people's actions because, believe it or not, people are freaking stupid and they just think they can do whatever they want and it's like, dude, we're in the middle of a pandemic, can you not? Texas is going to start hitting the 90s this weekend. I'm not ready for summer. Like, no. <sighs> Can, like, the coronavirus, like, read the room? Like, how rude is that? Let me know what you're watching at the moment because I need some Netflix, HBO, Hulu, whatever um, recommendations. Just recommend me the show. I'll figure out a way to watch it. Except if it's on Amazon Prime. The thing with this palette, it's really cute and some really nice pigmentation out of these colors. The only problem is you cannot really do like a whole lot of blending or layering of like colors because it's gonna just look really, really, really patchy. So yeah, primer. Um, for primer, I got this new one, uh, Future Dew from Glossier. Look how pretty this packaging is though. Like, the bottle is so freaking pretty, isn't it? so it has some color that's what it looks like i hope this is not too much oh it's a little bit thick or like sticky whatever it smells like gas station soap <laughs> No, it really does. <laughs> if you know what I'm talking about, you know. So now that I have my gas station soap on, no shade to Glossier, okay? Like, it's cool. As long as it looks nice. So, yeah, it gave me, like, this really pretty dew. 
Um, but anyway, when I did, like, I went to go do a facial with this girl beginning of the, when the pandemic was going on and she was just taking, like, her last clients. Um, but yeah, I went to go do, like, a deep clean, like, facial with her. I loved her and I wish I could go again, but obviously, like, I can't. Her work is over there in Juarez, so obviously I have to wait for this shit to be over. So, like, literally, this is how my skin looked after the facial like my face was so glowy so hydrated so beautiful loved it oh i'm gonna be wearing the fenty beauty i wore this one yesterday um and i like i love this foundation but it just gets like like if it doesn't get too like at first i feel like it gets really oily on me and then by the end of the night, like, it kind of cracks on me. So I don't know if it needs, like, a more hydrating primer. I need, if I need to use less. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to be using less. Um, and see if that makes a difference. Because I, I feel like I'm just applying too much. Does this even like match my neck? I hope. I don't think so. I think it's like darker than my skin. I think it is. Born this way multi use sculpting concealer. The best, best freaking concealer ever. Um, I actually ordered like a lighter shade because I had ordered golden beige, but. And I'll use it every now and then um, when, like, it's, like, nighttime. But during the day, I will not use that concealer because for some reason, that one has, like, a really strong golden undertone. I mean, it's golden beige, but it has a very yellow undertone. So by the end of the night, like, it looks super freaking yellow for some reason. By the So, yeah, it just shows up, like, super yellow on me. I'm so excited because Fenty Beauty released a cream bronzer. Cannot wait until that gets here. Um, just place my order because um, your girl is VIB. So I got that 15% off from Sephora. <laughs> Did y'all see that um, Tatcha came out with that new liquid um, silk canvas? I'm so intrigued to like buy it. But I'm like, girl, that's $52. No. <laughs> like, is it really worth it? Because I don't think so. Um, but if Elf wants to come out with a liquid poreless putty primer, I just wouldn't complain, you know? Honestly, like, I would have never thought... I was gonna be somebody that enjoyed like doing makeup like I was a matte bitch kind of girl like matte everything but you know lately with this aging turning 23 almost 30 um <laughs> I just I need to look young again so the do is what it what it is so glad that's what's like in right now so i'm gonna go in with the glossier wonder powder oh, i remember when my cousin bought me like this powder for my birthday he still had the wilder i still have some from like she bought me like she bought me that two years ago and i still have some because like i never wanted to finish it until i had a backup but this time she, i had the medium and this is a light one pretty fresh mist i was so sad because obviously colourpop you can't order anything from colourpop you can but they can't promise delivering anything there i believe their distribution centers are closed so i just ordered this from ulta for the longest time like i would add shit to my bag like i would add one of these to my bag like be looking at other products and when i was ready to check out like 
I am out of stock. And I signed up for their email and then I kept checking literally every freaking day for it. A second time, I saw that it was in stock right away. I was at work so I couldn't place my order and then when I got out of work, I tried to place the order and it just, again, out of stock. Okay, I checked and they did have it in stock and when I tried to buy two, they're like, no, just reducing the quantity to one, I guess, because it's in like high item high demand or something but this is the most amazing setting spray it's only $12 and it has 3.72 ounces I believe yes ma'am I'm good with numbers I'm good at remembering like specific numbers <laughs> this elf 24 karat gold um, highlighter I'm just going in with my butter bronzer. And right now, I found out that House of Flowers had released new episodes. I was like, what? Like, how come nobody told me? I mean, Netflix tells me, but, like, I never pay attention. I also ordered um, the Makeup Forever Reboot Foundation when they were having, like, their 30% off. When was it? I would say, like, April 11th. Well, it's not getting here till like May 11th or May 13th, I think. That's when they like predicted. I was like literally a month, which I completely understand. I'm not mad, but I was just very shocked that it's going to take a month to get here. Anyway, I got it for $27, so I'm very excited about that, trying that foundation. So we'll see how that one goes. Anyway, I'm going to go in with this blush right here. This waterproof Physicians Formula eyeliner, and I'm just gonna be doing like a very simple line, little mini wing, if you will. Okay, so I bought a boy brow from Glossier, and then I also bought brow one brow flick um, in the shade brown. So I don't know which one to use first. Honestly, I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use mine with this one. Honestly, kind of shocked at the size. It smells like the one from e.l.f. And this is like expensive. Oh my god. I'm like super impressed. <laughs> wow. Maybe you can tell because my brows are just super freaking like thick. Oh, this color smells so weird. I don't know. Sketchy. This one right here for my inner corners. It looks a little too glittery, but fucky. Okay, for lips, I'm going to be using this Lippy Stick Crayon in the shade Shaka. Okay, and this is the final look. Okay, obviously I don't look like Lily Collins, but um, her makeup in one of like, sh in a show in Paris, it was like 60s inspired. <laughs> yeah, really cute. I love her eyebrows. I feel it. I wish my eyebrows were like that, like thick. Anyway, that's everything for this video. Hope you enjoyed. And if you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I would highly appreciate it. And I want to thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. And hopefully I can see you on the next one. Whenever that is. <laughs>